anyway. Sorry, I got an email. Hi vlog, welcome back to my channel. Um, I'm getting ready to go see Taylor Swift at the Eras Tour in Los Angeles. Um, I just got a couple packages. Well, this is just a eyelash fan. This is what I actually need. My friend dropped off a bunch of bracelet making stuff. So this is what I truly need. <sighs> yeah, baby. Wow. She's small. Here. I hope I like this, so I'm gonna... Can you take a wild guess of what era I'm going as? This is so cute. Reputation, baby. Um, I will say though, it is not quite big enough. Like it's big enough for me to tie around, but I was gonna wear a bikini bottom and now I don't think that's going to be appropriate if I only wear bikini bottoms with this. However, it is still cute though. That's kind of lame though. That it, I mean, I could just wear these. This is fine. Ah, but like, I mean, it doesn't ruin my whole outfit, but like, it does kind of make me sad. It's cute. It's fun fresh so yeah I think what I'll have to do is just wear this like with the biker shorts that I'm literally wearing right now and then wear the top I don't know I need to figure it out still this is really cute but as you can see like half of my side wasn't there so that kind of sucks but this is my good side anyway so but woohoo so I have my sequin skirt and then I'm torn with what I want to do for like the top situation I either want to um no I either want to do um just like a square neck bodysuit with that and then or I have this that I wore to Miss Madison's Bachelorette, which is obviously rep era too. So I think I'm gonna do the top this, but like not have the skirt down, but I haven't quite decided completely. So we're gonna do a couple try-ons and figure that one out and I'll come back to you. Okay, so I have the fit. I'm gonna wear it like this. I think it looks cute because I can still get like half and I you can see a little bit more leg over here. Totally okay. And then I have heels that I'm gonna wear to the show, like to the venue, and then I'm going to obviously change out of those because she goes on for three hours, but sorry. I love you, Taylor, but I can't do that. <laughs> but yeah, so just the fit. I wore this for Maddie's Bachelorette, like I said, but it's okay. Do a little different, have a little sparkle, you know? I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. I was like in the worst mood ever. And just like, I was excited. And I like, this is the only thing I've really been looking forward to this entire year. But I was just stressed and like, you know, everything and like about money and all that stuff. But it's almost here. I'm so excited. You want to go to errands with me? You could be my emotional support cat. I'm just kidding. You are my emotional support cat though. Pop up. But yes, don't let roll this now. But I'm so excited. Um, so tomorrow my plan is to I have to get well, I'm gonna go to the gym because I definitely want to get a workout in before I leave. So I'm gonna go to the gym, I'm gonna get an oil change, and then I have to go do laundry at my sister's because my lovely washer dryer unit broke. They're ordering me a new one. 
So gotta do that and then I'm just gonna clean my house and we're gonna leave at a bright and early like 4 a.m. on Tuesday and go from there. Yeah. Hello update. I'm leaning back on my couch because my freaking back hurts. But I've been making friendship bracelets and the very first one I made literally fell. All the beads fell off. I wanted to cry, but it's fine. I've made three. Um, they've progressively gotten bigger. I didn't really mean to, if I'm being honest. But, um, so the first one says Mad Woman. Okay. The next one says, um, I've Loved You More from all the girls I loved before. But I loved you more. And then this one's like hella big for some reason. I don't really mean to, but whatever. Um says for the hope of it all <sighs> because August is very near and dear to my fragile little heart and I have this sleepy girl just <laughs> being annoyed by me but she chooses to stay right here so you know huh but yeah so I'm three in and like I said my back hurts a little bit so we're just gonna continue in a second. I've been watching Miss Alicia Marie this whole time. Because she's my comfort YouTuber. Her and Miss Remy Cruz, but you know. I realized I never showed you what I'm working with. And also, I've gotten beads literally everywhere and it's stressing me out, but it's fine. So Jessica came by Makuni this morning and Gave me all of her letter beads. Not all of them. She has a lot more. And then all of these little teeny tiny beads. Which like. They're so hard. I literally brought out my tweezers. Um, Actually I don't even use these for the beads. Because that would be kind of difficult to do. Hello. Anyway. But I've made six. Let's go in order of how I made them. Ready? So this one says mad woman. Okay. Um, what was the next one? Mad Woman's the name of a song. This one is, it says, I've loved you more. And that one is all of the girls I've loved before, <laughs> which she played in Santa Clara. And I'm so freaking sad because I was literally, I was supposed to be at that show. I wasn't supposed to go to LA. I got Taco Bell for dinner. I wasn't supposed to go to LA. I was supposed to be in Santa Clara on July 29th when she played all of the girls you've loved before and I wasn't there. But it's fine. Anyway, I digress. <laughs> it's fine. And then this one was really big by accident, but it's fine. It says, for the hope of it all, which is from August. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's just, hits me. Hits me in my feelers. Anyway, this one says, I can see you. I can see you. No, I'm just kidding. It's the name of a song, obviously. And then, duh, duh. For some reason, in these freaking orange ones, I couldn't find two L's, so I went with white ones. And lastly, you saw this one on TikTok. Bad, bad girl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so that's where I'm at with the friendship bracelets. It's 11.25. Oh, I'm exhausted. So I'm going to clean this up. I was going to sweep. I just, please don't eat the beads, guys. They they look like they're sleeping. I'm talking to my cats, obviously. <laughs> um, I'm exhausted. I'm going to clean this up, like I said. And then I'm going to go to freaking bed. And then I have a lot of stuff to do tomorrow. So. All righty. <laughs> My workout is done. Gotta go home, grab my cash, go to the bank, go get an oil change, go back home, take a shower, go to my sister's, do laundry. Hello. Yes? What? It is much later now. I've ran around quite literally all day. I had I had this whole fiasco with trying to pay my registration because online for some godforsaken reason it was um trying to have me pay like a 50 dollar fee <clears throat> and i said 
absolutely not. Um, I don't even want to pay the $272. So me and my sister had to run around and find a kiosk, even though we ended up being able to do it over the phone for $5. Love that for us. But yeah. And also my freaking, I had to get an oil change and it took, it should have only taken like an hour. I was there for like two, almost two and a half. So got all that done. I got my first Brazili. It's about you. Shout out Kiana. Actually, it actually wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. It did hurt, but we survived. Um, I finished my laundry. I just put all my laundry away. I did a quick like 10 minute clean on my apartment. Um, I'm all nice and packed right here. As you can see, here's all my era stuff. Sorry, that's my um, fruit hanger. But yeah, I'm about to upload a video onto the YouTube and I still need to wash my freaking hair. But I did shave my legs earlier, so we're good on that. So I quite literally just need to wash my hair, do a quick body rinse, and then blow dry it. And then I can go to sleep and have to be up at a nice brisk 4 a.m. So let's get to it. Hello, I just got out of the shower. Um, I wasn't gonna update again, but I'm about to start blow drying my hair. I'm so, I'm so upset. I shit you not, three, four hours ago, we were talking in my little group chat for the Eras tour. We were talking about what are your top five songs that you'd want to hear tomorrow night. I literally wrote Dress, Exile, Dancing With Our Hands Tied, You're Losing Me, and then if she wants to play false god again but let me fix my towel but she literally played dress and exile on the same freaking night like what is my luck it's just like on uh the 29th that's the show i was originally supposed to go to because it was in santa clara and it's closer to me blah blah whatever that was the show I was originally supposed to go to, but we couldn't get tickets to it, so we got an LA show. She played all of the girls you've loved before. And that was like one of my number ones. <sighs> I'm seriously like, sorry, you was playing in the background. <sighs> I was literally in the shower and one of my, my friend texted me and like sent me the TikTok link and I was like, oh my God. And like dress got done and then she starts playing on the piano and all I hear is the fucking opening line or the opening key to exile and I was like I just want to die ah! literally like this totally is not like that big of a deal but listen when you've been waiting since November to see Taylor Swift and all you want to hear is a song that you really like and everything is getting taken it's okay fine I'm gonna be in the presence of Taylor Swift tomorrow still excited again all right i am done with my blowout um honestly it's still a little damp like around my like the crown of my head and stuff but this my face look great kind of look like in the 70s with how poofy my hair is however i want it to be done by midnight and it's 12.02 so happy about that i'm gonna put a little bit of like oil in my hair just a little like just to you know just for the ends you know what I mean maybe some leave-in just a couple of drops because I don't want it to be dirty by any means you know but hold please Alrighty, I've got so much hair, so big, but it looks fabulous, so yes, alright, I'm going to finally try and go to sleep, and I'll be up bright and early at uh, 4am, maybe 4.15, we'll see, but yeah, see you in a bit. get it <laughs> oh that's the worst part is leaving I need 
no babies. Hi, Bobby. my teeth and then I do have to feed my sourdough starter and change my cat's litter box and then I can leave. <sighs> Hello. We've been in LA for a little bit. We're getting some food. Checking in with the vlog. Rajo and this waiting for our sandwiches, so. I've literally wanted to try this sandwich for months. The chinocado. It is so good. I get the hype. So basically I'm a terrible YouTuber. We just went to Girl Tribe Co. And they just dropped an arm and a leg. But I also got a shirt. Thanks, Jess. Oh yeah. Hello. Okay, I just got done curling my hair and I'm not really putting on much makeup. Um, both dresses are in there finishing up everything. I'm in the middle of putting glitter in my hair, just straight up in it because send it. And then I have this and this. I'm gonna put on some highlight for sure too. I actually don't even remember if I brought highlight or not. I'm sure one of them have it, so. Oh my god, we're right outside the mother freaking stadium. Oh my god, I'm getting emotional. I don't even think that you can hear me. I am so excited. Like, okay, we just got our merch. We're walking in. I am quite literally losing my mind because this is the only thing. I've looked forward to it since November. Holy shit. This is this is the fucking beer. Center stage. <laughs>
Say fit. This fourth blue. This fit. is her duster. Taylor Nation is live. Oh fuck you. Recorded as in Taylor's version. Oh, no. Take your off the speaker. What is happening? Try to go to the Griffith Griffith Griffith? The Griffith Observatory. Griffith. Griffith Observatory. Yeah, we were gonna try and go there, but we left really we left her house really late and then I there was just a million people there and there wasn't any parking. And so we I was like, let's go find a dessert place. And Marley failed to see that we were going to Hollywood, which is just not <laughs> the best idea. 
but right next to the ice cream place that we were gonna go to, they had beers on happy hour for $9, a uh, 34 ounce. Is it 32? Or? No, I think it's 34. I'm pretty sure 34 ounce beer for $9. So we're sharing. And then we're gonna get some ice cream. Feel it. Woo! <laughs> There's like a cinnamon, freshly baked cinnamon sugar cone in there. Oh my god. Hello vlog. I realized that I didn't check in after I think the ice cream shop. I don't know, I'll figure that out when I'm editing. But I'm on my way home now. And yeah, I have about four hours and 45 minutes left, so that's fun. Um, wearing my Taylor merch, and also just jamming to Taylor Swift, obviously. Would you expect anything else? I did like stack up a bunch of uh, podcasts that I wanted to listen to, but truly all I wanna listen to is Taylor Swift right now, and I'm just listening to uh, a playlist that somebody had made on Spotify when the tour first started. And so I'm just listening to it in order and I'm just sitting here like, <laughs> and like, uh, just reminiscing, you know what I mean? So yeah, but the drive's not too bad so far. I'll get home around six. So that's fun, but maybe check in later, maybe not. I don't know, maybe I'll check in when I get home and get reunited with my children. I miss them. I never checked in, I'm so sorry. I got home and I sat on the corner of that couch for the rest of the night. I didn't want to do anything. Um, it's like eight in the morning. And I'm just getting my day started. Um, I am going to be doing like a fun, ow, motherfucker, damn. I am going to be doing a little reset, but I'm gonna be starting a new vlog. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you had fun with me. I had the best time ever, like, if I can do that experience 10 times over, I would. And it was just absolutely amazing. And I can't wait to see her again, but we'll see. See you in the next one. Bye.